Well, a big night ahead for players and fans alike here in North London. I'm Derek Ray on the commentary gantry and sharing duties with me today, Stuart Robson. And every reason to believe we're in for an entertaining match here. It's the United States and they take on Sweden. Thanks, Derek. Well, often we talk about the tactics, the individual players, players that are missing, but so often it's the mentality of the players that is key to winning any football game. Which of these teams has the right attitude today is the big question. Here's how it looks for the United States. Well, it's a 4-3-3 with two out-and-out -out wingers, but they do vary their movement. They give width, but they also make diagonal runs in field when the ball's on the opposite flank. Their performances will be key today. Aslani. Well, they're on the scent of something positive, and credit is due for that good piece of defending. Tobin Heath on to Mewis Hertz crossing possibilities and making the move to the inside oh goodness gracious me it's a special special goal from miles out Here it is again, and just look at this. It's such good technique. It's a wonderful strike from that range. So underway again here. One nil the score. Moving it forward. But a good piece of defending to bring it to an end. Sam Mewis. Good looking sequence. So a deflection, and they can get ready for the corner kick routine. It's a short one. Dal Kemper. Setting it intelligently. <laughs> Lindsay Horan. And Morgan. Tremendously strong in the tackle. And a good looking pass. The verdict is offside here. Heath. This looks promising. Body on the line. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. Moving forward effectively. So it's going to be a goal kick here. Sam Mewis. Now here's Rapino. Rapino. And they find a gap in the defense. But it was a good looking sequence, but it comes to an end. 
Glass. On to Jakobsson. Kosovari Aslani. Here's Jakobsson. Aslani. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Well, slightly off target, and that'll be a throw in. Amanda Illestet. Glass. Sofia Jakobsson. And Aslani. Sega. Rolfe. They're still searching for the equaliser, but not passing it anxiously. Cuts it back. This could be the equaliser. No more time left. That is it for the first half here at the home of Tottenham. anticipated plenty of talking points so far and now the second half is underway Horan skipping away but a good piece of tidying up Kosovari Aslani plenty of options Not to be this time. Kruger. And snuffing out the danger. Amanda Illestet. Into the advanced position. Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? unable to keep the ball Rolfe can't argue with that little move could play it in Aslani chance here oh denied by the first well they were so close to the equaliser there they're certainly a bit unlucky but they need to make more of these chances Oh, the threat is there, and there she is, at the double, nobody can get close to her. Well, let's look at this again, Derek, because the transition when the ball changes hands is so quick, and then what a finish. That's been hit with such power and pace, the keeper has no time to react, it's a brilliant strike. A second goal for them here. A really effective shielding under pressure. And scope for them to produce something exciting. Alex Morgan. And they stopped them in their tracks. Aslani. Now with Sega. I think you've got to conclude that was good refereeing. A free kick in the end after initially playing advantage, but it just wasn't there. Corner coming up. And they're making a change. Delivering it. Struggling to get it away. Now 
fine reading of the situation. A oh, terrific pass. Well, now in a dangerous position. Well, quite simply, not precise enough from that position. They decided that now is the time to go to the bench. Jakobsson. It's looking promising. Not high quality defending. Losing possession. Eriksson. Jona Andersson. On to Sega. And now passing it through. And it all counts for naught. Perfect challenge. Juliet. Can they take advantage? Going for the dink. Well, well, well. How many players would have the confidence to try that? Simply magnificent. Well, let's see this again. This is counter-attacking football at its very best. And just look at the finish. That's a brilliant piece of skill and vision to chip the goalkeeper from there. What a great goal. This is looking rather comfortable for them. 3-0. And the referee has added on two minutes of stoppage time. And there goes the final whistle. And the home fans are going to be happy about this outcome. Well, Derek, it was a very assured performance, wasn't it? Particularly impressed with their play going forward. Really lively and almost cutting through at will at times. The result never much in doubt, if I'm honest. Crossing possibilities. Oh, goodness gracious me! It's a special, special goal from miles out. Terrific pass. Well, quite simply, not precise enough from that position. Can they take advantage? Going for the dink. Well, well, well. How many players would have the confidence to try that? Simply 